Good after evening noon. It is Vince. It is the 29th of May, 2024. And I have just received a rather exciting email from Hamshack Hotline Admins telling me that they are making my life and all of yours with a 10 digit phone extension just that much easier because they are now reprovisioning us. They've already reprovisioned us with a seven digit extension. That means in my case, a whole bunch less zeros in it. Should be easier dialing plan for everybody. So stay tuned and I will step you through how I reprovisioned my SPA 525G from Cisco. Be right back. So first off, before we get going, no ham shack hotline upgrade is complete without a visit from Wrangler the Shack Dog. He's a good boy. He's a three and a half year old Shiba Inu. Are you a good boy? Yes, you are. Good boy. All right, so I have the email opened up on screen as you can see here, and I'm reviewing it and it says uh, that ham shack hotline is migrating away from 10 digit extension numbers and replacing them with seven digit numbers. This means that all 10 digit numbers are being converted to seven digits. Well, that seems straightforward enough. For example, if your current extension number is 61 Zero one two five. That's a mouthful. Your new digit, your new extension number will be sixty one double o one two five or six ten zero one two five. Your number has already been created on the HHUS server, so this applies to those on the HHUS server only, and is ready for use. So here's what you need to do for users that have an IAX two truck trunk extension, which I don't have. You need to modify your setup. And it gives you the, a click here to, for trunk setup instructions. For users with a hard phone in order to use your extension, and that's what I've got here. I've got my Cisco SPA 525G, which I found used for really cheap. I was super happy with that deal. Uh, for users with a hard phone in order to use your new extension, you will need to provision your phone. So it says click here for provisioning instructions. And remember that reprovisioning your phone will erase any manual changes and customization you will done. So for example, if you had your one touch buttons here uh, provisioned with something, you might want to do a screen grab of those in the Cisco SPA 525 manager before you uh, make these changes so that you can rebuild them. Uh, and it'll uh, erase any manual changes and customization you will done, so you'll have to re-enter those things. For those that are savvy enough, you can skip auto provisioning and go into your phone's UI, locate your extension number field, remove three of the zeros from the middle, and save those settings. Please do not touch the password field. Hey, that sounds like a plan for me. Um, all users, you have 30 days from May 29th to change over to your seven digit number. We will deactivate all 10 digit extensions on the HHUS server 30 days from today. That sounds like by the 28th of June, you got to get this done or else your phone's not going to work anymore. We truly hope the seven digit numbers will be easier to remember and make using Hamshack Hotline more enjoyable. All right, so the note goes on to say you can put in a ticket under a general inquiry if you have an issue. So let's take a look and see uh, what that phone's IP is and we'll log in straight to the UI and I'll make those changes that way uh, because I can do that on the Cisco 525. Let's go figure that out. And look, it's an incoming call. Good after evening, noon. Hey, how about that? I guess it worked. Yeah, I guess it worked too. So what do you see on your display with respect to my phone number? It says line one connected to Vince VE6LK 6100291. Beautiful. Okay, so it's a relatively straightforward process to update the phone. Um, you just need your IP address and you go into admin login and advanced 
and you just have to touch two things is phone and extension one unless you want to reprovision your phone which means reprogramming everything that you've customized awesome thank you so much thank you okay talk to you later see ya bye, bye. maybe it's that simple I hope this helped you as much as it helped me. Now I'm going to go type up the instructions so that somebody else can go do it. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. 73.